Hi, I'm Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about online photo sharing. Let's say you've been on vacation and you've taken a whole bunch of pictures of your vacation and you want to send those out to all of your friends. Well, there are too many pictures or the pictures are too large to send an email to so many people. So applications have kind of sprung, sprung up across the internet that will allow you to upload your photos and then send links to those photos to people in email. That way they can open up a website and view your album. Uh, this is one of the uh, main features of photo sharing on the internet is being able to upload your photos uh, and send them to friends regardless of what their email account limit might be uh, and you're not filling up their email inbox as well by doing so. I'm going to show you one of the more uh, popular ones. It's called Flickr. It's flickr.com F-L-I-C-K-R dot com and you'll need a, um, a Yahoo account to sign up for Flickr but it's a free uh, sign up and it allows you to upload photos that you've taken. Uh, I just did a quick search here um, from everyone uh, for the word Hawaii and uh, as you can see many people have uploaded their photos and you can uh, click on these pictures to, uh, to kind of look at them. Now you need to keep in mind too that these photos are copyrighted by the people who took them so it's not like a free repository of photography but uh, you can upload photos just to your friends you can upload photos that you've taken to where everybody in the world can see them like this one of this uh, dolphin here swimming and you can add descriptions to each and every picture that you add up here and people can uh, add comments to your images as well so that's some of the benefits of online photo sharing and if you're taking a lot of vacations or if you are a photographer that's something you'd definitely be interested in. I'm Dave Andrews and I've just talked to you a little bit about online photo sharing.